Hello everyone, Nick of Street Pass Princeton here to play another episode of Ultimate Angler. So let's get started right now. Oh, I just remembered something. I'm gonna have to hire some anglers, because I didn't do that. Do I? Okay, let's invite some anglers right now. Inviting the anglers. Invite as many as possible, yes. Okay, you're all set, so it's time to go. Okay. Get some bait. Bait on here. Okay, so... Okay, so, um... Alright. Oh, really? That's it? Okay, so the mysterious giant... I don't think I'm gonna get it this episode. But I do like the fish in this... That, in that, uh... There. Pacific bluefin tuna. Okay. I think I have a higher chance for this, so we'll just try this side for now, and then go to the other side in the next episode, depending on how this episode plays out. So, yes, and yes guys, I'm doing the single bait thing, single baits all the way. Okay, I feel more confident now. I get that boost, nice. Okay, this is a tougher one, obviously. It already gets to where it needs to get to, which is great. I'm doing fantastic here! It tries to get away from me, but it's too late, cause I got you! Wow, that's big! Pacific Bluefin Tuna, 128.96 inches. Okay, so there's like 12 inches in a foot, 36 in a yard. So that's got to be like, I don't know if that's as tall as me, because I'm like 5'8", no, 5'9", I'm 5'9", so, yeah, I'm done. I'm so done here. Just get me out of here. Okay, um, uh, yeah, we're good. Get that boost! Oh, again? Okay. I mean, this is a pretty easy big fish to catch. So, we're almost broken the distance barrier. Is this bigger than the last one? I think this is less big, but I get a nice rod with it, which is cool. Okay, I get the sturdy chest, sword rod, I get 6,000 gold, which is great. Another challenge completed, 100 toy species plaza ticket time, and that's gonna be that island until we come back to try to catch the bigger fish. Okay, I can't fit it there, but maybe the other tank? Okay, I have to upgrade one of the tanks. I'll upgrade this one. Okay, so that should be... Yeah, this is the bigger one. So that's it for this fish tank. Um... Okay, uh... Make new rod. Uh, I guess I will? Make a new rod? Can I even? No, I shouldn't. I like the angel rod, but I'm probably just gonna stick with the angel rod. Uh, I think I might improve the angel rod, though. That I can do. Um, I'll definitely do the gauge span. 
and the pulling power. And probably pulling power again. So, and then next I'll do another gauge span, and then that'll be it for this rod, because it'll it's pretty good. Um, if I compare it to the one I currently have equipped, it's not too bad, honestly. Because this one has slightly lower gauge span. Actually, gauge spans, they're both pretty close. But if I had to choose one, last chance boost power is pretty... I don't know. I think that would be pretty good to have. So, anyway, guys. Improved a rod 50 times. Oh! I guess they gave me more money to improve another rod. So, I gotta sell a rod, though. Um, I think if I sell this anchor rod, I can probably do it. Yeah, let's just sell the anchor rod. Why the heck not? So we sold that anchor rod because we're going to improve this rod to the final thing what needs to be, which is the gauge span. And I just did it, so we're good there. Um, I don't think... I think the other place is going to be probably... I mean, as much as getting the extra pulling power and durability is important, in my honest opinion, I mean, a last chance boost is great, and plus I think the other place isn't on the coast. So I'm not going to get that coastal gauge boost. Plus, you know, having a last chance boost is not pretty is pretty important. So I'm going to end the episode here, so you guys know the drill. Like this video, leave a comment below. Don't forget to subscribe. Check us out on Facebook, Google, and Twitter. Leave a comment below, like this video, leave a comment below, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye!